today I want to talk about dressings for the engine bay. Hello friends, hello, hello. So today I want to talk about dressings that you can use for the engine bay. So you're doing a car lot detail. I've explained this to you probably more than you want to hear. However, um, if you're doing a car lot detail, don't waste your time washing the engine. Unless it is specifically requested and they pay for it, I suggest you do a basic wipe down. It takes me five minutes. It takes me longer to open and close the hoods on many of them than it does to do the engine bay wipe down. That is what you should do for a car lot detail. But you gotta make it look decent, right? You know, make it look like it had a professional clean. Let me tell you about car lots. Car lots, the interior and the exterior are eye appeal is by appeal for women. For the men, they raise the hood. They may not see anything wrong, but if they see that thing looking smooth and cool and clean, they're good. Not kidding. <laughs> So let's start with the first one. This is the first one that I will use from time to time, but technically I will not use it on a car lot vehicle, but it is an option. It is the Meguiar's Ultimate Insane Shine. And it's pretty affordable, but it is the brand name, so it's not as affordable as it could. I use this um, very few times on a car lot vehicle, but I will use it for my outside customers. So here is one. This is also a brand name. It is Chemical Guys Tire Shine. You can use this on the interiors. You can use this on the black stuff on the exterior, obviously on the tires. And you can use it on the engine bay. This doesn't take much. You can see I still got quite a bit in there. This does not take much. You can spray a little bit on your towel and wipe the plastic parts on the engine bay and that's really all you're gonna need. It does not take much. It is some pretty good stuff, but, um, and I will tell you that if the seller has to do their own vehicle, they will make that thing look good with tire shine, no matter what it is, interior, exterior, and the interior. Here is one that I found at Walmart, and I actually like this one better. I bought one can and then I picked up another one the next time I went to Walmart and that is black magic tire wet this is good for that engine bay in fact I don't use this on anything except engine bays you will see me use this on all of the car lot details I spent seven dollars and ninety six cents on this bottle both times and I still have quite a bit in this first bottle. The other one is sitting over there in the cabinet. This is a good choice. So this was just a short video. I just wanted to kind of go over some options. You can go and buy your expensive stuff for your outside customers. But if you're going to do a car lot detail and you are expected to do something with the engine bay, that is the best option. If you're going to do a car lot engine bay, seriously, do a wipe down. Um, if you want to, you can have a pump sprayer and do it that way. Use a brush and get it cleaned up, but don't go all out. Because they're not going to pay you for that. Now, if they're paying you for that, do it. Do it 150%. If they are not, and you're paying like my rate is $100 per car. That includes exterior rinseless wash and the interior and the engine bay wipe down. That's all. And then I dress it. That's it. That's it. Keep it short, keep it sweet and simple, and you are going to save yourself a lot of time and headache. Just wanted you to know. Have a wonderful day, everybody. Thank you for hanging out on my channel for a minute. I sure do appreciate it. If you'll take a minute to hit that like button, maybe leave me a comment. Uh, give me something to, to uh, respond to or to not get nasty about. You know, I had to do that a while back. 
Um, but maybe something you want to see me doing with that car lot detail, let me know because I'm always looking for video ideas. And then if you're not a subscriber, I would love to have you. So hit that subscribe button. I would sure appreciate it. And until the next video, we'll see you later.